Hey everyone, Chivos here, back for another Football Manager 15 video, here with Eastley, and today I will be bringing you the FA Trophy Final, but first I'd like to cover a few things. Firstly, we need to have a look at our schedule. Last time I saw you guys was the AFC Telford game, just before the Barnet FA Trophy Semi-Final Second League, and that was when we beat AFC Telford 2-0. So since then, our streak has continued. It's quite surprising, but it, it's continued. Uh, we took uh, Barnet to penalties in the uh, FA Trophy uh, semi-final leg two, and we ended up winning. I think it was 4-2. We won on penalties. Quite a thrilling game that was. Before we then played away at Southport, where we got a 1-0 win. Fraser Franks picking up his first goal of the season, and then. We played away to Bristol Rovers, who were, I think they were fifth or sixth at the time, and boy, we smashed them. James Constable coming back, picking up four goals in that game, and Stuart Fleetwood picking up two. So a 6 0 thrashing, could not believe it. Before, we did play Chester, and what do you know? They learned from the Braintree game, they put us on TV once again, and we won 2 1. Jamie Turley, leaving it late, scoring in the 91st minute. Before, we went back to Silver Lake Stadium, where we did play Barnet again, and we beat them 2-1. Very close game. We did leave it late to score again, 84 minutes in before we got the, the crucial goal. Before, a one-all draw with Macclesfield. They did score in the 93rd minute. Very frustrating. And an away game with Grimsby, where we scored a 67th minute penalty to tie the match up. But as I said, today will be Wrexham in the FA Trophy Final. Damien Mozika is suspended and Matthew Fletcher is out. But apparently Wrexham have five players out injured, so we will cover that in a minute. But the other thing we want to talk about is youth intake. That is correct, we have had our youth intake. And I'll bring you the under-18 squad now. Bang. Here he is, right here. Sonny Stone, the best person we had come through the ranks. I don't think he's that good, to be honest. Um, he's not bad. You check the reports, though. His current ability is not very good, so hopefully I will loan him out. Um, he's got potential to be a good conference right back, so that's not bad. But he won't be of any use to us, and everyone else is just not, not really good. Like, you look at Tim Abbasey. Not not very good player. So, very unfortunate that we did have a bad youth intake. But, you know, these things happen. And then, under 21s, we still only have Lewis Noyce. Um, apart from that, finance-wise, yes, we are still on the decline. But things have obviously steadied up. It went heavy. And with our FA Trophy one run, things have steadied up a bit. We are still looking at a massive loss. But... As you can see, it started off very, very high, uh, like low, and then it dropped. So, problems are occurring, but what can I say? Things things are working out. Um, so, that's that there. Balance is what we want. So, there you go. And projected balance, they reckon it's only going to get worse and worse and worse. So, we need to turn things around. That's all I can say. Um... Schedule wise, uh, uh, competition wise, as you can see, we are fourth. So we're still in the playoffs. Uh, Gateshead have run it clear. They've got six games left to play. So theoretically, six games is 18 points. So technically, a lot of people can still win the league, but they've pretty much secured their playoff spot automatically. Um, here we are. We're on f 40 games played as well. Uh, we have one in hand over the other teams. So if we did get the three points, that would push us 74 points. We'd sit in second. But as you can see, the drop, 68 points to Lincoln. So we could still finish sixth, and that could ruin our promotion party. But uh, our playoff party, sorry, a playoff party. That is playoffs. But looking at things, finances, we're struggling. Board, we are struggling. But with the club, it's not too bad. Um, the chairman loves the club but our finances are horrible so they might even get out a loan to cover the debt which I'm not too happy about 
but if we keep progressing, we can pay the loan off quickly. So apart from that, we haven't really bought anyone, we haven't really gotten rid of anyone. Um, Squad-wise, everyone's back. Damien Mazzucco is suspended, Matthew Fletcher's out, but uh, most of our loanies have come back now. Frederick Champion and Jake Fowler are still out on loan, which is good for their development. We will be letting go of a lot of people in the future. Dean Howell doesn't want to sign a contract with us, but I need him to, so I will have to uh, organise a new deal with him. So we'll do that very shortly, because I would love to keep him, and he knows the financial status of the club is not very good. A lot of our players might have to go, unfortunately. But what I'll do now, I will join you at the game as we progress. And here we are. Looking at things, Ross Fitney will be signing in goal. Um, Dan Spencer, the right back. Paul Reed, Jamie Turley, Fraser Franks. And Dean Howell as the centre backs. Uh, Jamie Collins, Craig Stanley, Jai Reason in, this, in the central of midfield with Stuart Fleetwood and James Constable. They're just higher goal scorers at the moment. So that's how we're going to go into things. Let's push on. Alright, so here we are. We One thing to note before this game is we have been a club for 69 years. Yes, 69. Everyone get your laughs in while you can. 69 years and we have never won the FA Trophy. So... Will today be the day? Let's find out. Hopefully we can turn our fate around. Because this cup run would be amazing and the finances are something we need. But it's not looking good. We are playing in the blue today. So, uh, hopefully the blue can really prove that they're better. But at the moment it's not looking good. Two minutes into the game. And we are on the defence quite heavily here. I think they're going to try and attack the game. And here they go. Big ball out wide. Ralph whips it in. And, oh no, that's a horrible start. So I need to calmly tell the boys. They need to concentrate. Oh. Yeah, I know there's a team talk, but come on. We need, we need to talk, right? So we'll calmly tell the boys to concentrate. That's what we need them to do. We need them to concentrate. Now we do have another highlight here. Collins, Constable. This is Howell looking for a ball. Back to Franks. Franks to Collins. A reason. Constable. Constable. Come on, you should have played in Fleetwood, but here's Collins. Back to Reason. Big ball over. Is Spence gonna get there? Yes, he is. Whips it in. Constable! Goal! We've got it back. One all, 27 minutes played, and that is what I'm talking about. We've got one back. Excellent news. Now we need to score another one or two, and we are playing at Wembley. As you can see, we have a lot of fans in the blue. So all the fans have come out to Wembley today to see us potentially win our first ever FA Trophy, which is excellent news. But we're approaching half time now and let's see what we can do. I'm sitting here thinking. I am thinking. But the question is what am I thinking about? The, th the thing I'm thinking about right now is what are we going to do? Because things are doing well. But we could be doing better, so I think we'll keep everything the same and just have to see what happens. Dan Spence, though, drawing a foul straight away. Need to keep an eye out for Craig Stanley. He's a, got a bit of an ego and uh, does pick up quite a few yellow cards. But stat wise, everything was looking good until that ridiculous free kick's gone in. What has happened there? What has happened, Ross? This oh. So let's see what Ross has to say about his mistake. Big free kick. Ross has just had an absolute shocker. So instantly we pause. No, we pause. 
and we need to have a team talk now and we need to be aggressive and we need to push forward none of this stopping and oh here we go Craig Stanley goal is that Frank score that was an own goal Fraser Franks pick up his second goal of the season and what a vital goal that could turn out to be FA Trophy final here we go Stanley nice ball in from the corner Franks just big kerfuffle there big kerfuffle but we have got the goal and now we're pushing 70 minutes played I'm gonna have to make a change but I don't change while there's a highlight and um, this highlight is not looking good for us we need hopefully a counter attack after this that's a big ball in surely not ref offside come on Oh, Paul McCallum so we are struggling now we are struggling so we are going to think about this we have Jack Midson on so Turley is going to come off Jack Midson can come up Paul Reeves not having a good game either is Dean Howell Craig Stanley's not looking good Jamie Collins can fill his spot and Will Evans can come on and then maybe gonna have to leave it like that but I will go to an overload fluid and I want a much higher tempo close down much more push much higher defensive I want to uh, I don't want to play I want to pump the ball into the box hit early crosses and shoot on sight we want to um, we want to really give the game to them we, we want to we push it so let's see if our tactic can change anything. We've got 15 minutes to get a goal. If things don't really happen, I will be forced to make more of a change. And that's how it's looking. And that's what I'm going to have to do. So what I will do is the hell formation. Where everyone moves forward. I could move Fitney out of goal, but I don't need to. Play him as the only goalkeeper. Um, we need to go for this right now. If anything happens, I don't know. So sorry about that little cut there. Just had a, a very important phone call. But we've gone for the overload here. And is it going to pay off? That is the question. We've got a lot of men forward. And we do have a corner. The question is, will the corner pay off? And it looks like it hasn't, but we still have everyone in the box. And it's not looking good. But we do have a throw now. Constable, Howell. Big ball in, Fleetwood, no! <coughs> oh, surely that's not the end of the highlight. <laughs> Alright. Throwing men forward. Here we go, Howell. Big ball forward, surely. They've made an error. Midson! Oh, it's 3-3. Three, three. It's 3-3. Three, three. Alright, pause the game. Pause the game. Pause. Alright. Back to what we were playing. We can't afford to lose this now. We can't afford to. Drop it back. Drop it back. Alright. So, control. Structured. And what, what do we want to do? We want... We'll just keep everything the same. But we'll control the play. I can't believe we just scored. It's 3-3, three, three, boys. And that is crazy stuff. Big route one ball. Hickford's made a mess of it. And Midson. Oh, lovely slot. Surely that'll be the end of the game. For now. Extra time. Absolutely scenes right here. Scenes, scenes, scenes. The question is, will the scenes continue? So let's passionately tell the boys, all we need is a goal, and they are looking happy. We need one goal and one goal only, and let's see if we can get it. I'm not sure if it goes just to plain extra time or golden goal. I'm assuming it is plain extra time. 
but we will soon find out, won't we? Come on, boys. Great tackle. Great tackle. Evans. Will Evans. Fleetwood. Great collection. Spence. Collins. Collins. Reason. Looking for an out ball. Here's Franks. Oh, he's made a blunder. Here's York, though, and Carrington. Looks like they've got men going forward. Great. Great tracking back, but they've scored. No. So I'll leave it till the half. I will leave it to the half, and if we haven't got it by the half, you know what tactic's coming up. You do know what tactic to expect. Oh, so if things couldn't get any worse, I think they have. And it looks like they're getting worse and worse. McCallum again, oh, he's just missed it there. Well, we're in trouble. Fleetwood, Midson, Franks, big ball out, Howell, ball in, surely, Reason, Howell, back to Evans, switch ball, Collins, Spence, great ball, Fleetwood, surely, Spence, Midson, Constable, goal, oh! yes, yes boys, 4-4, four, four. oh, Everyone is going nuts right now. It's 4-4. This could not be any more hectic. Look at this. I'm just pumped right now. Just, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is crazy. And it's starting to rain. Not, not on the game. In my house, it's raining. Here's York. Well, not in my house, but McCallum. Surely not. Spence. Cleans up. Come on, boys. Come on, York. Alright, excellent. We could be going down to penalties. Penalties it is. Oh my god. Alright. Jack Midson will take the first one. Jai Reason. Stuart Fleetwood. All oh boys. Jamie Collins. Dean Howell. Followed up by James Constable. Fraser Franks. Paul Reed. Will Evans. Fitney and Spence. Here we go. Penalty shootout. Midson steps up and scores. Oh, sorry. I've pushed the wrong button. Scores. McCallum. Oh, he's just put it through. Fleetwood. Scores. This is crazy. Harris. He scores as well. Reason. Oh, bangs it in. Ashton. Oh, he scores two. Three, three. Three, 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 three. Collins. Scores. Ooh. It's four, three. Surely Carrington's going to miss. Oh! This is so... Fitney saved it. Come on, Hal. Come on. Come on. Yes! Boys. Boys, boys. Scenes. Hashtag scenes in the comment section. We have done it. We have done it. We have won on penalties. Oh, my God. What if? What has just happened? They scored in the third minute. They bought, We got one back in the 27th. We left it late. So, then they scored in the 57th. We got 64th. Then they scored in the 72nd, and we left it to the 89th minute. 89th to take them to extra time. And then in extra time, they scored. We got one back. Took them to penalties, and we've, we've dominated. Ross Fitney, the big man, making the big save. Oh. 
the first FA Trophy in the club's history. What is that? What is that? So, 4-4, win on penalties. We win. Oh my lord. Please read this bottom section. It says, it represents a phenomenal turnaround in fortunes for Chulo, who earlier this season was reported to be one bad result away from the sack. Retaining his job and proving his doubt is wrong will make this success all the sweeter. So we have, we have just won the FA Trophy. Yes. So, is there anything else we get for winning this? Let's ha let me check this out. Check the rules. Right, we just won 50k apparently. That is all you get. But right, 50k. All right, I will do the team talk in a minute. So we did have to pay out some bonuses, but it is worth it. 50k for winning against Wrexham. And that 50k is massive for us, to be honest. I am praised by the Eastleigh supporters. Couldn't be happier. Look at the confidence from that FA Trophy win. Full. I've never seen a full confidence bar before. Proud day for the fans. Alright. Here we go. We won. We have won. FA Trophy, don't worry about that. The main thing we want to look at, obviously finances will be slightly better. It will, obviously it's not going to show straight away, but it's slightly better. And, I mean, well, what can you do? Review the confidence here. FA Trophy. Right, they wanted the fourth round and we won it. FA Cup. We got, they wanted the first round, we got the second round. Conference, they wanted a respectable league position. We got playoffs so far. And what what a result. I I'm so chuffed. That is so good. Ross Fitney making it big. And who knew? So anyway, I need to look at the, the next fixture, so we're on the final stretch now. We're not gonna overtake Gateshead, we can try, but we're not going to. So what I'm thinking is I might join you for the last day of the season or I will join you for the playoffs. Either way, you will know when the next video comes out. But my name has been Chivos. Thank you so much for watching the scenes that occurred today. And I'll see you on another Football Manager 15 video.